This fall, more kids than ever before have been parked in front of their computers and their tablets. So clearly, computer skills have become more important than ever before. And the future holds a lot of careers that will require the ability to code. Tonight, we have got some time with an instructor teaching kids about coding and game design. Ben Leskovansky teaches at the Insight PA Cyber Charter School. Ben, thank you for joining us tonight. Yes, thanks for having me. Why do you think kids are the perfect students when it comes to learning coding and game design? Yeah, I, you know, I think kids uh, nowadays, now more than ever, um, are into technology, whether it's using a cell phone, using a tablet, playing video games, you know, that's, that's very popular among my students. So they have this natural tech savviness, uh, you know, that they acquire naturally, just, you know, just playing with their phones, tablets, games, uh, on the computer, especially, you know, online students. So I think what's awesome is you have that segue to talk to them about how coding affects their lives every day. Mm -hmm. uh, so it really gets their, yeah, I use a cell phone every day. What makes that work? Or I play this video game all the time. Uh, you know, what makes that work? And that is coding. It sounds like a, a perfect day for students to have an excuse to be on their computer. What does a typical <laughs> day look like for the students that you teach at, at this school? Yeah, so a typical day, uh, they are on, uh, you know, with classes throughout the day. You know, they do have breaks uh, throughout the day as well, but they're in class, you know, from eight to four, again, with several breaks in between. Uh, so I see a variety of students, different grade levels, different uh, skill levels. Uh, so our pathway, you know, we have beginner coders and then advanced coders. Uh, so throughout the day, they're taking their regular gen ed classes and they're getting these chances to take uh, elective classes in coding, game design, and we have some other pathways as well. Uh, so the kids are, are interacting with the teachers on the microphone, on the camera, uh, in text chat. Um, so it's very, you know, very lively and uh, very interactive for being online. What types of jobs can students eventually land if they are great at coding? Yeah, no, that's a great, great question. So specific to coding, they can become a software developer, for example. They could become a web designer, game designer. Uh, gamification right now is huge in education. So creating games around educational topics could be a job. Mm -hmm. uh, and the other thing I'll say about coding is it is everywhere. So no matter what field they decide to go into, I think there's going to be some sort of technology uh, that coding will help them adapt to and apply skills to that field no matter what they pick. How much joy has coding brought to your life? Oh, it, it is amazing. It's, it's what got me into teaching. I, I mean, video games is probably what got me into teaching coding specifically because I was a coder before I was a teacher. Uh, so that's what got me into it. Uh, and it's just been very rewarding to share this passion with students. So combining teaching uh, and my passion for coding and game design has, has been amazing. Ben, thank you so much for taking the time to talk with us tonight. We really appreciate it. Yes, thank you for having me. Have a great night. You too.